Wolves had lost their last two league matches without scoring, but manager Kenny Jackett was in cheerful mood. A win here could have taken his side top, and they struck first. James Henry on loan from Millwall picked out Danny Bart with a death touch. He scored his first goal since February. But the advantage didn't last long. Ben Pringle with the initial corner for Rotherham. When it came back to him, he picked out Nua Dicko to score his fifth goal in six appearances on loan from Wigan. Pringle was also involved with much of Rotherham's attacking play. Kieran Agard's jump superbly timed, his header powerful enough to give them the lead and end a dry spell for him of three matches. And it got better early in the second half. Pringle again, this time it was Dicko's broad chest, his second goal of the game, and Rotherham led 3-1. But six minutes later, a lifeline for Wolves. Up went the heads. Referee Michael Oliver spotted a handball. Craig Morgan, perhaps the cold crit. Bakary Sacco's second successive penalty of the season put Wolves back in touch. And some delightful football involving Dave Edwards. He found Henry, who began his loan spell with three goals in successive games. And he showed real composure here to deliver the equaliser. Wolves might even have won it. But Sacco's long-range effort was parried by Adam Collin. 3-3 it finished. Walls now level on points with leaders Leighton Orient, who lost at home.